Well, recently India invited some lawmakers from the European Parliament to visit Jammu and Kashmir. Now, Finland's Foreign Minister Pekka Haviesto uh, has become the first European Minister to visit New Delhi after India's decision on Jammu and Kashmir. In an interview to Beyond World is One, after his talks with Indian leaders in New Delhi, the Finnish uh, minister said that the issue of Jammu and Kashmir would be best resolved by India and Pakistan alone. Take a listen. Here, of late in India, we're seeing a new trend of uh, what some people in India call anti-India protests happening across mainland Europe in particular. How would you, Rick, uh, you know, respond to this allegation or accusation that the EU is perhaps not doing enough to uh, you know, prevent such anti-India protests from happening uh, within the borders of the EU? Well, of course, we uh, respect the... the overall uh, principle of uh, freedom of expressing your political uh, views and, and, and opinions and so forth. There are demonstrations pro and contra. I just want to refer that when uh, Minister uh, Jai Sankar came to Helsinki, there was a big group of fans of, of India around the inauguration ceremony of the Gandhi statue. And right. I think Minister was also surprised that it was a very positive happening. But of course, people can also react to the human rights situations. Kashmir is very much discussed and, and so forth. And I think the freedom of expression is also a very important principle. Since you mentioned the subject, where, uh, what is EU's position, if I might ask, on this issue? Well, of course, we hope that uh, the, the uh, Kashmir problem uh, will be solved between the, 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 the partners, between the countries, uh, Pakistan, India. Of course, they are holding the key, and I think nobody can replace the, 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 the countries themselves to, to find a solution. I also, uh, when discussing with the minister today, I, I mentioned the issue that it would be good to have maybe international UN observers on the, on the ground, and maybe the diplomats from New Delhi could visit the country. Transparency is always a good principle.